looking to save some money as we deal with inflation. So Amy Mitchell with the Better Business Bureau is here today to share some ways you might want to consider. So we know inflation is hitting everybody's pockets when it comes to gas, food. What are some tips you have for us? So my first tip is to look at your budget. Look what you spent last year. Look what you've spent so far this year. See where your costs have raised and see where they've gone down. See if you can adjust those or certain things you can cut out. Or maybe you're like, oh, I didn't know I spent so much on fast food last year. Maybe we'll cut that one back. So check where you are currently. Then the other thing is, is your current vehicle okay to maybe stick by for another year or two? Not sure, then maybe invest in a new one, but if you can stick with your current vehicle, maybe get it fixed up a little, that's another way to save some cost. Perfect, and also investments. That's a lot of things that you know people do. Is that something that people should support or should they do that? I would still time? continue to invest in the 401k and things that you're doing. Keep those steady. The market's gonna go up and down. Just ride with it unless you're in a situation of retirement or something like that right now. And then that's a whole different ball game. Um, another thing I would suggest is start shopping around. Use the coupons, go to the grocery store. Is this one priced differently? Does this one have a sale this week of 25 percent off groceries can I can I pick them today you know versus my normal store or are you not using all those subscriptions whether it be a mail service for makeup or one of your subscriptions for TV whatever it might be is there something you can cut that's gonna save you 10 15 bucks a month cut three or four of those it makes a big difference Perfect. And I was doing a little um, research. They say maybe people should consider getting, you know, another job during this time. Would you recommend that? I mean, you absolutely can. There are still a lot of people looking for work. Of course, you don't want to overwhelm yourself. So if you can start with looking inside your home and seeing where you can cut some of those costs. I mean, everybody went through 2020 in the pandemic, which means we all did a lot of improvements to our home or got more games, board games or did more activities out outdoors. Use those as to your availability while you've got them. Perfect. And talk a little bit about how your business has been impacted as far as like, you know, the rise in inflation. It's been great. Better Business Bureau over time has stood the test of time for over 100 years. So whether we're in inflation or or different things, we've done well. So BBB is good and we're here to support anything you might need. Watch out for scams. Check BBB before you do anything. Perfect. Well, thank you, Amy, yeah. for joining us as always.